loves, welcome back to another video. I know I've not been posting regularly, but I will post as often as I can until I'm able to resume a weekly upload. As you all know, there's a lot going on at the moment which needs my attention. But today I wanted to share with you how to organize a work bag because Gust and Luga kindly sent me this beautiful backpack. And I have to say it's absolutely gorgeous. The quality, the size and the color are exactly what I had in my mind for a new work bag for my daughter B. Now Gaston Luga has some gorgeous designs and the quality and durability is everything you could look for when making a purchase. So the bag comes with a protector which I have been keeping it in. Let me just show you. We got this black and tan design with these sturdy shoulder straps which are faux leather and of course adjustable. And the safety fold is also leather, making it look very chic. The seams are also very neat and crisp, and I definitely love the gold detailing. It also has these little gold feet to help keep the bottom clean, and in this pandemic, it is all the more important to maintain hygiene. For additional protection, the corners are fortified with leather patches as well. Now, while the outside is for leather and canvas, the inside is lined to protect the contents with a waterproof lining. Now, like all bags, organization is the key to keeping your bag functional. I want her to be able to retrieve things quickly without having to rummage through yesterday's napkins and tomorrow's schedule. And that is why for a non-sectional like this one, I needed to use pouches and little bags to corral like stuff and separate the different categories. To complement this bag, I got these pouches to help organize everything. One tip to choosing organizers is to use the bag as the color palette and then use these colors, add complementary and accent colors to create a visually attractive ensemble. I try to avoid using too many similar colored or similar size pouches because that just makes it more difficult to distinguish. Vary the sizes and the colors for efficiency. I got a full variety of pouches in different sizes, different colors and looks to organize and complement the bag. I have made a checklist of some of the common things that we need to have on hand, which you can use as a guideline for your own bag. And you can download this printable from my blog. First on the list are her office needs. She will need her planner, some stationery, a notebook, and maybe a binder to keep her documents organized. So here we have B's planner, which I bought for her at the beginning of the year. And along with that, we are using this matching pouch for her stationery and supplies. Even though not bought together, both are from Typo and have the same design. It's kind of easy and intuitive to pair this bag with this planner, so you know it's everything stationery related. There won't be any confusion when she reaches into her bag which pouch she needs to grab. In the stationery pouch, I want to include some work tools. So besides having a few pens, I have also ordered a ruler and a mini stapler to add to this. Since there is this pocket in front, I'm using that to contain her paper clips and clamps. I have opted to use a very light muted shade of gold so it doesn't get overwhelming. And I have organized these in separate organza bags. I also got her a notebook so she can jot things down in a book and all her notes will stay organized and won't be easily misplaced. Her jottings go way beyond the scope of the planner, so a notebook is essential. However, that's just a personal option as one planner might work well for others. Along with this, I wanted to help her organize her tech. There is a slim compartment in the bag which is perfect for an iPad. Another advantage is that if she does not want to carry a separate wallet for her cards, she can use these slots in the iPad cover to organize her cards and maybe some cash. It's convenient for her to just stand her iPad up while she's working. Now still on tech, we also have things like earphones and chargers to accommodate. So this pouch here is dedicated to those items. This pouch is not new, but I feel it adds some character and texture to the ensemble. In here, I have added this rechargeable cordless charger or power bank, which I purchased online. She just needs to plug it in directly into the phone 
making it easier to use than one with a cable. And this also works for the iPad too, so that's a great thing. And these are her AirPods, and if she still needs to store earphones and charging cables, I got these leather look clips, which keep the cables from getting tangled. I really like these, and these are available in many colors. I personally got them in blush, black, and tan for us. Now to keep her documents safely, I also got this document holder in the same faux leather as the bag. And I also got her these super pretty dividers so she can separate the documents for each project she's working on. And she can also add labels to it. And these fit super well in this folder. I love the contrasting design and color against this background. Having covered the essential work needs, I also need to take care of her personal needs. So let's begin with this baggie for masks. Whether for her own use or to share with others, a few extra masks are always handy. It is just something inexpensive I got online, but I do like the gold detailing. The next pouch is for her toiletries, in which she has her saline solution, a contact lens case should she need to remove her lenses. Then she keeps a travel size roll on and this sanitizer, which is so elegant in this spray like bottle. It looks more like a perfume. Now this bag just has some sanitary pads and hand tissues. Like I said earlier, most of us have some unique requirements of things that we need to have. So for B, it is this long pouch. It contains the box for her aligners, so she needs to be able to store her aligners. She also has a mini mouthwash, and since she has to brush her teeth each time she puts her aligners back on, I have included a bamboo toothbrush, which is 100% biodegradable. Of course, it's for B, it has to be, and some toothpaste. Besides these, I also have an umbrella to cater for the random rainy weather we endure all year round. I was quite lucky to have found one that matches her planners so well. I mean, look at the polka dots, it screams coordination. And of course, a bottle of water to stay hydrated. Now let me show you how I organize everything. When putting things into the bag, try putting them upright so they don't sink to the bottom, which will make it harder to get to. I start with specific items like the iPad and then work my way from there. It is important to keep everything retrievable without having to dig deep. Putting the organizers back in the same place will also help you reach for stuff more efficiently. Now at the back, there's a small place here, which is perfect for her card sleeve, a space for her to keep her, her business cards and cash. Now be it her ID card, access card or credit card, I want her to be able to get to them without fumbling or holding up the line behind her. Now for extra convenience, I've also added another hand sanitizer here. After all, we can't be too careful I thought this was really cute and it doubles as an accessory with this little tassel. She also wanted me to add her reusable shopping bag here. All she needs now are her car keys. And oh, on her keychain, I've also added this little gadget. It's a great item to have handy, especially when you need to push a button in the lift. Now I'm really excited for her to start using this bag and I'll let you know her reaction on Instagram. So my loves, I hope you have enjoyed this video and have gotten some ideas for your own work bag. And do let me know in the comments which item is your favorite or what else I should add to her bag. I would like to thank Gaston Luger for sending me this lovely bag. I will leave you a link to the website in the description box below. And until the next video, this is Ravina saying happy homemaking and please stay safe.